hello and very very good morning with a new video today i want to show you how to do the generator diesel generator service look at this generator this is the main two generators this is the cables coming from the generator here from two generators and this is going to the main panel this panel is connected with generator and to the outside to your uh, to your plant for any uh, residential and this is the tank fuel tank uh, is coming here connected with this walls to the two generators you can see here and these two generators uh, and this DB is supplying power to your uh, plant now look at the fuel line fuel line is connected here okay this is the main panel for your generator from this generator you can control you can read your you can take the reading from here this panel now look at the filters this is the new filter and this is the oil filter you can see and this is the diesel filter that cooling and the last one is the air filter you can see later and this is the new filter now we will change here look at overall the generator now okay before starting uh, service oil changing you need to switch off from here your uh, switch off the engine of the generator and this is the main breaker uh, for the generator supplying to the main panel to the main panel you can see the reading here everything here so now we are starting this oil filter through the motor and this motor connected this pipe the pump is taking so first you need to the wall this wall must be close you can see this red color wall okay this is the uh, filters I show you I will school in and that one is the air filter you can see at the top this big one we will remove later uh, you will see here <coughs> but uh, here this two filter we need to change must is the oil filter and here you can see here we are injecting the oil uh, engine oil here you will see and now this is the drain lines drain line everything is here so drain line we need to open first the wall okay uh, but first we need to connect these two pipes once we connect these two pipes then we need to open the manual but first we need to check the your readings if it's completed the timing and your kilowatt hour okay so when it's completed like the next service is 42014 and you can see here so if it completed you need to start your uh, uh, service so you can see this the main panel first we need to switch off this one and it's the date everything is showing here look at here 4201 and next service so already completed now we just switch off the engine and let's connect the pipe to drain the old oil engine oil once we remove this uh, drain this oil oil then we will supply the new oil <coughs> so for this one you need to give uh, you need to provide some proper tools to connect this one once you connected this one then you need to start your pump drain pump to drain the oil from your engine open the valve you see and now we will go to start the engine from the car this is the service car and service vehicles now the start generator and also start this uh, we need to put this buckets everything to uh, put some oils <coughs> and now you can see we will remove also the filter how to remove this one you see the tools this tool you need to use this uh, you need to use to remove this one to rotate and it will be easy for you then you can drain your oil so now the process starting you can see how they are removing the uh, filter rotating counterclockwise and put here but we need to take some sample for the laboratory and put it in small bottles this for uh, testing purpose we need to check the oil uh, oil uh, quality everything in the laboratory okay this all all uh, this is the oil filter first we are removing this uh, oil filter after that we will start this uh, diesel filter <coughs> we need to try and we need to keep proper uh, housekeeping put in your uh, can and then we can take out this one to a proper place just blow this one now we are fixing new filters new filters now we are removing the diesel filter this is diesel filter why we are using filter 
for the purpose to drain the some dust some particles it will not passing through the engine so that's why we are putting this filter and this filter is good for the engine uh, reliability see this is a diesel uh, filter now we will put the new filter you can see the second one also now removing once we remove so the new filter we need to put uh, diesel first in the filter before fixing this one because if we put these why we are uh, putting diesel here you see for the purpose air blockage sometime it will be inside air will be uh, calm and it will make problem for the generator so air blockage we need to put some this one now it will not block air inside so first you need to put this compulsory you need to put this for the diesel only not for the oil only for the diesel you need to put first this uh, diesel diesel inside the filter and fix again this one so look at our wall clean very well everything is fine now just connect it very nice thing. thank you guys you are support and you make very well good service now they are tightening very well once you tie clean very well now we will remove the air filter just losing the nut and bolts remove the cover then we will remove the filter and this filter air filter we need to clean through the through you know uh, through uh, air blower to remove all the dust clean very well if the condition is good no need to change this air uh, filter if the condition is not good you can change this one now you can see we will put some air blow outside you can see inside inside is nothing you will see inside is totally empty like a hole look at here okay it's fine now you can clean here very well through air high air pressure blower okay now it will remove so it's better you clean very well or then close this one and check this one now this is overall generator you can see just to our view from every angle from every side once you fix your uh, filters uh, and now just remove this one because also drain the oil finish you can see here is all oil finish now remove this one fix the block mm -hmm. and close the wall already and once you fix this one and finish just remove see some oils we are draining this one finish this one now look at this all everything is finished so now what we will do now we will supply the new oil through this pipe see this is the injector side inject the oil now start running you can see so the total oil capacity in this uh, oil you see like it here total oil capacity in this engine is 103 liter total so we are fixing this one see now 5 is 32 it will go very fast now you see it's coming from the car side 99 see 100 and 103 it will stop put a little bit more because for the this oil will come also to this filter so a little bit more is okay see now is okay 103 and we can check the gauge first clean this is the high level once high level but little bit more from the high level like uh, two centimeter three centimeter see a little bit more so it will come to the filter automatically also just remove this one you can see now just fix this one and finish this one oil is changed filter change and now we are removing the pipe keeping back this one in our car overall you see during the service of the generator you also should to care about your batteries inside if there is an acid you need to check the acid level but here we are using water so you need to put water check the water level if it's complete you can see here it will not visible very well but you can see look at yeah is water is full and also for the same other uh, battery also you need to check this battery also see look at the water level is okay it's fine so you can use this water uh, to fill and all everyone will be same so check just check the water level everything will should be fine 
and you can see the general the battery are connected in a parallel connection to complete 24 volt and look at all this generator is uh, now is fine so clean everywhere very well during your service so you can see now look at the overview of the engine look at here and now we just uh, use this air blower to clean and clean everything very well to remove the dust and just close the door and start you can start normally your engine so you can see here everything so thank you so much guys for watching kindly subscribe like and share with your friends thank you so much for support and have a good day